hello students welcome back to my channel in this video we shall deal with non linear pd of type 4 that is the clairaut's equations the equations of the form z is equals to px plus qy plus f of p comma q okay so any differential equation which is of this form that is z is equals to px plus qi plus f of p comma q is called as the Clairaut's form and the complete solution of this equation is given by z is equals to ax plus by plus f of a comma b that is simply replacing p by a and q by b in the given equation we get the complete solution of the given equation okay so solutions are very simple so let us consider first problem solve z is equals to px plus qy plus p square plus q square so first we write the given equation you can observe that it contains x terms y terms and z terms and it uh, it is of the form px plus qy into f of p comma q so therefore this is in clear roots form Therefore, replace P is equals to A and Q is equals to B in given equation so that we get the complete solution is Z is equals to Z is equals to AX plus BY plus A square plus B square. So this is the complete solution. Next question Z is equals to PX plus QY plus log of PQ. So again it is in the Clairaut's form because it is of the form PX plus QY into sorry plus function of P and Q. So therefore, this equation is in clear roots form. So therefore, replace P by A and Q by B in given equation. Thus, the complete solution is simply z is equals to ax plus by plus log a into b. Okay, so like this, simply we can find the solution that is complete solution by replacing p by a and q by b. Now uh, let us consider one more example z is equals to px plus qy plus pq given equation z is equals to px plus qy plus pq is in Clairaut's form So therefore, put P is equals to A and Q is equals to B in given. Then the complete solution will be Z is equals to AX plus BY plus PQ. PQ means it is AB. Okay. Next one. Z is equals to PX minus QY minus sorry. Z minus PX minus QY minus C into so it is equals to C into 1 plus P square plus Q square. 
okay solution this is this equation so that is we can write it as z is equals to we can write it as that is take these two terms to the rhs side px plus qy plus c into root of 1 plus p square plus q square is in clear roots form therefore substitute p is equals to a and q is equals to b in given so that we get the solution is equals to z is equals to so given equation z is equals to px means ax plus by plus c square root of 1 plus a square plus p square so this is the required solution okay so similarly so let us consider one more example on this one that is fifth one z minus px minus qy whole square is equals to p square plus q square okay so this is the given equation solution given equation that is this can be written as we can write it as z minus px minus qi equals to so taking square root on both sides so square get cancels here we get square of p square plus q square sorry square root of p square plus q square or this can be further written as z is equals to so take these two terms to the RHS side we get px plus qi plus square root of p square plus q square so now this is in clear roots form therefore sub replace p by a and q by b so you may consider this as equation 1 so in 1 thus the complete solution is z is equals to ax plus by plus square root of a square plus b square next problem show that the complete integral of the equation px plus qy minus z whole square is equals to 1 plus p uh, sorry is equals to 1 plus p square plus q square is ax plus by plus cz equals to a square plus b square plus c square to the power 1 by 2 so you can observe that here simply if you replace definitely it is in the clear roots form but simply if you replace p by this small a so you won't get the complete solution in this form so therefore first we let us consider this that is we replace this p by capital a then we go for the solution that is you can see here first the given equation can be written as it is equation can be written as px plus qi minus z so this square is taken this side it becomes square root of 1 plus p square plus q square ok so it can be further written as z is equals to okay so we are sending this z to this side and then it becomes px plus qi minus 1 plus p square plus q square now this is in the clear form okay this is in 
clay roots form therefore replace p by capital a and q by capital b you can use any constant here okay so therefore the solution is z is equals to ax plus py minus square root of 1 plus a square plus sorry here so i'm taking square root we get plus or minus here so we use plus or minus plus or minus square root of 1 plus a square plus b square but for the required solution we consider only positive sign okay the positive sign is sign is taken to get required solution okay so now to get the required solution we substitute capital a by a divided by c because in the solution part it is given by in terms of c therefore we use c here that is a is replaced by a by c and minus a by c and b is replaced by minus b by c so therefore this z becomes minus a divided by c into x minus b divided by c into y plus square root of a square means a square divided sorry 1 plus a square divided by c plus b square divided by c so further simplifying it can be written as a by c into x minus b by c into y so in this it is c square c square c square can be taken outside so square root of c square is we get c under root we get 1 plus a square plus b square now c can be taken common that is 1 by c is taken common we get 1 by c is taken outside so that we get minus a minus b plus square root of 1 plus a square plus b square or this can be further written as z into c c is taken to this side z into c is equals to minus a minus b plus square root of 1 plus a square plus b square so it can be further written as a plus b plus c into z is equals to square root of 1 plus a square plus b square so therefore the complete solution okay thus the complete integral is a plus b plus c z sorry it is ax by it is also ax into by so it is ax by the complete integral is ax plus by plus cz is equals to 1 plus a square plus b square to the power 1 by 2 okay so like this we can solve the type 4 uh, non linear pd that is standard form of non linear pd which is called as the clay roots form okay and whose solution that is complete solution will be obtained simply replacing p by a and q by b in the given equation okay so you try this problem by yourself that is uh, find complete solution z is equals to px plus qi plus p square plus q square okay so this is in the clay roots form you can get the solution by simply replacing p by a and q by b okay and your answer will be z is equals to ax plus by plus x square plus b square